going to show you our three phase fully controlled thigh resistor bridge converter with triggering circuit. So, this is the trainer kit order code is 46559. This is the mimic diagram given on the trainer kit. There are two DPM digital panel meter. This is DC volt meter range is 0 to 200 volt and this is DC current meter range is 0 to 2 ampere. This is the MCB. This is also the main switch to turn on or off the kit and to get the output we need to push this button. So, this is the three phase connection and this trainer kit needs to be connected with a three phase power supply like this. This is the user manual and patch cost these all are included in this kit and to do this experiment we will need a DSO or a CRO to perform to sorry to observe the output waveform. So, first I am turning on the kit <coughs> and to get the output we need to push this button. So, the kit is on now. We will observe the output waveforms at different point. So, this is ground TP2. So, connect the negative terminal of the CRO here and the positive lead of the CRO at BO2 see the output waveform. So, this is the output waveform uh, at the point BO. Now, we will observe output waveform at TP1. Now, TP3, this is the output waveform of TP3. Now, we will observe TP4. Now, we will observe TP5. This is the output waveform of TP5. We will observe TP6. This is the output waveform at TP6. Now we will observe FC like this. Now we can we will observe the GRG here. like this also. You can observe the other triggering pass. like this. And observe the change when we are varying this controller potentiometer. Now, our second object is to study the operation of a three phase full wave controlled bridge rectifier with our load. So, for this we will need to connect build this connection to perform the experiment. So, first connect GRK here with GRK. This is ACR1 and GRG with GRG. Also connect this load with our load like this and this with this. Now connect GRK, this is SCR4 with GR dash K and GR dash G with GR dash G. We 
we can see that there is 6 SCR and we need to connect all the SCR. So, connect D Y K with D Y K here and G Y G with G Y G. Now, connect G B K with here G B K and connect G B G with here G B G. Now, connect G B dash K with G B dash K and G B dash G with G B dash G. There is one more SCR left. So, this is G Y dash K with here G Y dash K here you can see. and g y dash g with g y dash g. So, now we will observe the output waveform in CRO. So, first connect sorry turn on the trainer key and observe the voltage across RL load. Observe the output waveform across the R load. Now, I am controlling this potentiometer triggering angle potentiometer this one and you can observe that the volt that the output waveform is also controlled like this. Our next experiment is to study the operation of a three phase full wave controlled piece bridge rectifier with RL load. So, for this the connection will be remain same we just need to add L load with this. So, first connect this like this and connect it like this with load and we will observe the output waveform across this load and we will also observe that how varying the triggering angle controller potentiometer has its um, effect on the output voltage waveform. So, connect this like here and the positive lead of the CRO here and we will observe the output waveform in the CRO. Observe the output voltage waveform in the CRO and also observe how it changed when varying this potentiometer. Like this.